Hi, I'm Steve from Fiberglass. Today we're talking about our System 2000 epoxy resin. System 2000 is a general purpose epoxy that offers the highest ultimate strength possible for a room temperature epoxy. It is a laminating resin, meaning it was designed for use with reinforcement like carbon fiber, fiberglass, or Kevlar. System 2000 is typically used in the production of both high strength and structural parts and in molds in the aerospace, automotive, and racing industries. It should not be used as a casting resin. While it is a room temperature resin that offers excellent properties when cured at room temperature, if post-cured at an elevated temperature, you can use System 2000 in applications with service temps of up to 200 degrees Fahrenheit. It has excellent handling characteristics for a structural epoxy resin, and the viscosity makes it easy to pour, measure, and use. The variable cures make System 2000 an excellent choice for anything from small hand layups to vacuum bagging and infusion applications. Variable cures means the resin can be mixed with any of our three curing agents, depending on the amount of working time needed. One of the best advantages of System 2000 versus other room temperature epoxy systems on the market is the high properties that are retained even with the long cure time options. The first hardener is 2020, and it has a 20 minute pot life. The term pot life refers to the working time of the resin, not the cure time. Number 2020 has a 4 to 1 mix ratio by volume. When mixed with 2020, System 2000 will cure completely at room temperature. The short pot life is great for structural repairs, simple fabrications, or parts that require a quick demold time. Parts made with 2020 should only be exposed to lower service temperatures. Our second hardener is 2060, which has a 60 minute pot life. It has a 3 to 1 mix ratio by volume. 2060 is ideal for standard part fabrication. The one hour working time reduces your stress during a frantic layup, helping you create the highest quality part. One hour is also enough for most smaller vacuum bagged and resin infused parts. In a thick laminate, 2060 will cure completely at room temperature, but for thin two or three ply laminates, some heat may need to be applied to allow for overnight demolding or sanding. Number 2060 only requires moderate heat to gel hard overnight. As little as 90 degrees is typically sufficient. Finally, 2120 offers you 120 minute pot life. It has a 3 to 1 mix ratio by volume, extending your working time for large or complex parts and medium to large vacuum bagging or resin infusion applications. Thick laminates will cure at room temperature, but for most laminates, 2120 should be given a cure of 12 to 14 hours at 120 to 130 degrees Fahrenheit to ensure hardness sufficient for demolding and sandability. As I said earlier, System 2000 is made for the production of high strength parts and molds used in room temperatures. However, with a heated post cure, the service temperature can be up to 200 degrees. A composite part sitting in the sun on a hot day can reach temperatures of 160 degrees, so service temperature should be a consideration in your resin selection. We recommend post-curing your laminate at a temperature equal to or greater than the maximum service temperature of your part. System 2000 is easy to apply in mold and directly to reinforcement fabric. It is compatible with all of our reinforcements, offering excellent bonding to carbon fiber. System 2000 Epoxy is available as a quart, gallon, and five gallon pail. If you aren't making structural parts, but need more strength than a polyester or vinyl ester resin can provide, our System 1000 General Purpose Epoxy may be an option for you. Alternatively, you may look at our System 3000 for parts that require higher service temperatures. All epoxy resins from Fiberglass are first quality, meaning you can expect the same properties and handling characteristics every time you order from us. You can check out our complete lineup and learn more about System 2000 when you visit product pages at fiberglass.com. Thanks for watching today. Don't forget to like this video.